السلام علیکم جی حسن خان فرام لندن ہائٹ پارک Uh, just wanted to share my thoughts on the conference I was here for. I was here for Pi Live Europe Conference 2024. It was on 19th and 20th of March. Or uh, there were about 700 plus uh, delegates from, uh, mainly from UK. Uh, there were a lot of like uh, people from uh, industry, uh, which I already knew. Uh, it's still about Canada. U.S., uh, Germany, Netherlands, and a few other countries are over there. And there were a couple of stalls uh, which were organized by different bodies like UCAS, PDE, Pearson, Miskela, Lackwood Cert, Oxford Test, Apply Board, and the rest is now. So they would also have like huge stalls over there. Uh, this meeting, uh, this conference may, uh, they were different forums, a lot of speakers, the uh, opening uh, uh, event, the opening uh, session, just me, Joe Johnson, he is very, uh, he's also uh, chair for uh, Future Learns, uh, he's also I think, uh, and I think he was, maybe he's not now, chair for uh, a board of director rather, for a ply board. So, Kafi Indep knowledge is Joe Johnson. Ka. He's also brother of uh, previous UK Prime Minister Boris Johnson. So, he's a good in-depth knowledge he has about uh, UK education overall in the, the industry. Uh, Iskela Bor, uh, there are very valuable personalities and people from the education industry. So, uh, they shared information about how the UK education is going on. Uh, for the challenges the UK education is facing at the moment or uh, how the government is going to tackle that. Yes, there are uh, a lot of like concerns from the international students. I mean, if you talk about Pakistani students, ke se so a uh, lot of concerns, yes. Uh, so those were discussed during these sessions and how to tackle that. Uh, uh, for example, who study work visa It also is in discussion just may uh, around mid may mac is a committee migration action committee they're going to give uh, their uh, findings uh, to the government so whether they are going to continue with a uh, post study group visa in the uk for international students or they are going to discard it or maybe bringing some changes so let's see how it goes uh, but still uk is and has been a uh, sort of like a priority destination for many Pakistani students or uh, we hope that I think the uh, UK government will uh, not bring any drastic changes that will uh, that will affect the international student and particularly Pakistani students so so that was the main agenda I think uh, that was discussed uh, during this session other than that uh, different countries like Ireland Netherlands France, um, they, they, they were like people from those uh, uh, countries, they discussed uh, how to, how students can come over there uh, to study uh, in, in Holland, uh, in France, in Canada as well. So, uh, we've got like uh, and a good networking, uh, definitely. Uh, I interact with a lot of people from, uh, not only from UK, system from uh, from the universities uh, but also from other uh, areas so overall it was a fantastic opportunity for me to attend and uh, uh, have a lot of discussion with them and in the future definitely it, it will uh, uh, give me and give us uh, my organization as I if I can something the opportunity to uh, work closely with the Uh, sector with the UK education and other bodies and uh, to improve uh, uh, you know to bring more changes maybe positive changes how we can give more uh, uh, assistance to the students and how we can give a better service uh, to the students in Pakistan uh, giving them proper service from the uh, admission to visa and onward so that's all from my side so thank you very much for this video and uh, 
will hope to meet on sharing more, you know, important, valuable information with you. Thank you. Bye bye from London, Hyderabad.